Pegs and Spire TV, and I'm your host, Inspire Princess Cooking. Christmas Cooking. Okay, so it's time to make cookies. We're gonna make uh, cookies, and we're gonna make candies, and we have our bananas so we can make banana bread. It's baking time. Okay, so we're gonna do this. We're gonna open these up, okay? And we're gonna use gloves because we don't want to get any germs on our cookies. I don't cookies. have any gloves. <gasps> you need gloves. You just need one. The okay. one that you're going to touch it with. Okay, perfect. so. Perfect. We got one. Yes, perfect. Okay, so we're going to take this and we're going to stick these beautiful little cookies onto the pan. Because we like this. to take little chunks of this yeah. and we're going to put them how about I break them and give them to you and you stick them onto the can yeah okay hold on that is nasty yeah because I already made a batch on it and I'm not going to get a new piece of oil for cookies okay are you ready uh -huh. this is gonna be good stuff. there you go you put them in order uh -oh. okay So the cookies are done. It took about mm, about 10, 15 minutes. And so we're going to wait on the cheesecake muffins. And we are going to start a new batch of cookies, probably peppermint. Okay, so whenever you're not sure, you take a toothpick and stick it in the middle, pull it out, and if it comes off clear, can you see that? If it comes off clear, then they're usually good. So I'm gonna flip it over and check maybe one towards the end. Nope, looks good. So the cheesecake, muffins, look good. Okay, so, so far we've got the chocolate pretzel, the peanut butter, and more chocolate pretzels. And that's one tray. Does it look store-bought? Hope so, because they're homemade, and but we stuck them in this beautiful case. And these are for the ones that are at home. We have the peanut butter, the chocolate and pretzel, chocolate and pretzel, and right now we're making... Um, sugar cookie with peppermint in it mm -hmm. so hopefully those will be good and then next we will do our uh, chocolate melt the chocolate with the peanuts and chocolate balls so how's it looking okay so now we are going to make the chocolate peanut clusters and the way that you do that is you want to add water into the bottom pan and you're going to put this one onto the top. You're going to start warming it up. So you're going to um, get this to a boil. I'm actually going to add a little bit more water. Because I feel like it needs a little. Because the water does start to evaporate. Evaporate. There's a word for you. Okay. So um, make sure you have parent supervision. You definitely don't want to do this alone at all. <laughs> and... Um, this should be done with a parent. So I'm gonna turn on, I'm gonna turn on the heat. Ooh. Okay, 
and that's gonna start warming up and uh, when it starts to boil at the bottom then I'm gonna add my chocolate okay so here's the chocolate I'm gonna open this up and we're gonna cut it into cubes and then we will put that into the pot okay so there you go there's the chocolate squares they're cut up and ready to put be put inside of the pan and then you want to have your spoon ready because when the chocolate is hot you're gonna add the peanuts you're gonna um, grab spoonfuls and drop them onto here and you want to do it in kind of a fast way because um, the, the um, chocolate will get hard so I'm gonna go ahead and start adding the chocolate in because what I like to do is actually start seeing them melt Okay, so Inspired Princess is putting the chocolate inside. We'll probably do one more. And, oh, you can see it's already melting. Okay, so we'll let that go ahead and melt. And we actually want to put this one down here because you want it to touch the pot. So as it starts melting more, you're going to start stirring it. And um, stir, stir, stir so it gets nice and um, creamy. And then you'll add the peanuts. Okay, so now we're going to add the peanuts. Just go ahead and pour them right in and stir it up. Can I stir? Mm -hmm. Sure. Hold on, let's get them all soaked with the chocolate first, and then you can stir them up. Okay. Mmm, they look like tiny little chocolate chips. Hold on, let me add a little bit more. They look like chocolate chips. <laughs> to peanuts you can always uh, substitute the peanuts with something different that you like yeah. um, people put uh, pretzels yeah. you can do chocolate covered pretzels yeah you can get the pretzels and you should you can like cut them up like like it's gonna be like peanuts kind of mm -hmm. they, it's not gonna be peanuts because you did pretzels and you can just cut them up so they can be just like this yeah, and the interesting thing is when you're dropping the um, little clusters, you're really gonna you're gonna put them on this wax paper, and you're gonna go ahead and just get spoonfuls like this, mm -hmm. and kind of do the dripping like that, and you're gonna take it over, and you're just gonna drop it onto your wax paper like that, and that will harden up and be a little chocolate candy, which yeah. is really awesome. Yeah. So first, to make a cluster. You just the same thing as this, and then you put it in the fridge refrigerator, and it will turn into a chocolate custard. Mm -hmm. And I love chocolate custards because they chalk. Okay, so this is what your this is what your chocolate cluster should look like when you're done. Um, they should be spread apart, and um, there's no need to put them in the refrigerator or anything. They actually just harden up and then you can do whatever you want with them i actually like cold chocolate so and peanuts is good <laughs> yes i would put them in the refrigerator but um the same chocolate that we have here uh we can do peanut butter balls so i think yeah. i'll do that next like on the TV. yeah okay just to show you this is what the chocolate uh, peanut cluster looks like Okay, so these are the peanut butter balls. They just came out of the freezer, and now I'm going to dunk them into the chocolate. That's the finished product out of the freezer. Okay, so have a Merry Christmas, I guess, and this I guess. is Christmas. No, it's have a Merry Christmas. Oh. <laughs> you enjoyed watching our treats and we hope you learned something this one looks these two looks the these prettiest. are reese's pieces peanut butter balls and it's so good Let's merry christmas them. thanks for watching yeah. bye if you want to make it make it <laughs> <laughs> bye oh bye. my god don't merry christmas like subscribe and all that good stuff uh, Woo bye, bye. bye. Tu le verás con la papaya.